So, Kaylin, because I know you'll make these improvements, I'm just going to read your paper with all the edits I'm suggesting, and you can decide, you know, which ones you want to use, which one you want to keep, but this will definitely make it shorter. 21 Pilots' triumph and return has been loud and clear with the release of their new singles, Choker. Choker is their second single to come out of their upcoming album, Scaled and Icy. Josh Dunn performs on the drums, Matt Pulling plays violin, and Tyler Joseph performs vocals and everything else on the track. Joseph produced and wrote the track himself as well, which is rare for musicians, especially in popular music. The song narrates personal struggles in a similar fashion to their old tracks. The song's meaning is not obvious and requires people to listen multiple times. When you get past all the, oops, after the listeners get past the, the cheesy glitter that is, the cheery glitter that is, the bouncy sound synth lead and wind track emulating drums, the lyrics speak fear and dealing with your own emotion. Everything you feel or experience within your mind is felt only by you. Semicolon. You must learn to accept and face those feelings according to Joseph's book lyrics. And I would almost cut that next part and then combine this next part instead of saying in terms of vocals, you might say in some parts which sound blunt in the okay. In turn um, the singing, especially in the verses, is not just as best. So you don't need to move in terms of vocals because he's singing. It is tinkering on sing talking in some parts which sound blunt and unfinished, possibly to enhance the mood and match the song's theme. And instead of this, do this instead. Although Joseph proved in previous tracks like Cut My Lip and Bandito that his voice has range, this track is a bit of a disappointment. So see, I've combined and shortened this sentence. It was a huge show off, especially during live performances in their last tour, so I was hoping the new works would take a turn to showcase his expensive, his expansive range. The chorus of Choker is rather simple, consisting of only three lines. It will definitely become a catchy or earworm with enough plays. Joseph adds a subtle reference to Leave the City, which is the closing track from their last LP trench. Fans will recognize how Joseph started with I Know It's Almost Over in Leave the City and transition to I Know It's Over in Choker. With the, the track concludes with a rap verse and a style that has been Joseph's signature for years. It brings this nostalgic sense, especially to older fans, to see Joseph give a nod to his original writing style. It goes to show that even after a decade of the duo making music together, some things they have thrown at the wall have stuck. The overall presented tone of the song is entirely misleading. It is, has an upbeat tempo and lustrous exterior upon first glance. However, upon further inspection, it has a very melancholy, melancholy undertone, a signature for 21 pilot songs. All of it... All of it together just brings this wave of sadness to me. Not enough to make me want to cry, but enough to feel some sort of pity for Joseph. By far, from the sound of Natalie Choker, but their first single they released titled Shy Away, this new work will definitely be marked as the band's pop album. It is much more upbeat than their usual darker sounds, but Joseph's lyrics have still not shied away from deeper themes. The Joker and Shy Wang, elements of synth rock and rock shine through, giving us a taste of what's to come. Their genre is always fluctuated between tracks and their past works, but it's a lot easier to identify with which box they will fit into with the sounds of their singles. Whether you love or hate their change in direction, there's no doubt the stool will be soaring to new heights. May 1 Pilot's fourth album, Scaled and Icy, is expected to arrive on May 21st with an accompanying live stream concert. So I think I read through all the changes, but I think I messed up a little bit in the beginning. But that's what it would sound like. Again, like just try to anything that's redundant, you can cut. Um, I'm pretty good at cutting things to the bone, but you have such a, a real talent that I know you'll, um, you know, try to keep improving. And definitely want you to be writing for entertainment next year if you have time.